eyes cut through me Hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Chemicals collide Hold tight, hold tight Hello YouTube, it's that game tamer here and today I'm doing a tutorial on the Iron Man Mark 46 and also this is a two part tutorial. I'm also going to show you guys how to install the Iron Man Tony Stark house. So first what you want to do is download the files needed. If you look down below and check the description, you should see all the download links. So don't forget to check out the description. Okay, so what you'll be needing is Iron Man Mark 46 add on ped and then add on peds, Iron Man V script, nibs mod, script hook V scripthookv.net, Lua plugin, and OpenIV. Let me show you guys how to install OpenIV. Open up the setup, press continue, read the terms except continue, create desktop icon and run OpenIV after installation, continue. So I already have it, so I'm gonna click no, but if you don't have it, press yes. So now what you want to do is open up your main directory, right click new folder, name it mods. What you want to do now is copy the update folder and paste it inside the mods folder okay that's gonna take a while so let's minimize this now open up open iv once open iv is up and running go to tools asi manager make sure you install all of these so asi loader open iv.asi and open camera once installed they're gonna be green okay so now you you can close open iv okay go back to your main directory so open up your script hook v download click the bin folder select script hook v.dll and then put eight Drag it to your main directory. Okay, next is scripthookv.net. Look for scripthookv.net.asi. Drag it into your main directory. Now what we want to do is Lua plugin. So open up your Lua plugin download. Select all the files and drag them into your main directory. Okay, now click your scripts folder and open up your nibs mods. Drag nibsmods.net.dll to your scripts folder. Okay, now open up your add-on peds. Click add-on peds. Click scripts. Drag your ped selector.dll to your scripts folder. Okay, minimize add-on peds for now. Okay, now let's wait for our update folder to finish pasting into our mods folder. Once everything is done pasting into your mods folder, click your mods folder. You should see an update folder inside update folder. You should see x64 folder and update.rpf. Click x64 folder. You should see DLC packs. Click DLC packs. Open up your add-on peds download. And inside your add-on peds, you should see DLC packs. And then drag add-on peds to your DLC packs. Um, let's go back actually. Drag add-on peds editor to your desktop. Okay, we can X this out. Now what we're going to do is install our Iron Man script. So drag this to your desktop. So drag your Iron Man V to your desktop. Okay, open up OpenIV. Go to tools, package installer. Select the Iron Man script mod you drag to your desktop. Click install and select your game folder. Once it's done installing, you should get installation succeeded. Now you can press close. Let's minimize OpenIV for a bit. Okay, let's see what's left. We have MK46 left. So what you want to do is um, click armors. Uh, go to your um, Grand Theft Auto main directory. Uh, go to your scripts folder, Iron Man V files, armors, and select all the files in here. Drag them into your Iron Man V armor okay so this was our mk46 armors and we select everything and dragged it into our iron man v files armors okay so now what we're going to do we're going to x our main directory out let's open up open iv let's go to mods update x64 dlc packs add-on peds dlc.rpf peds.rpf click edit mode press yes all right now go to your mk46 Click MK46 PED, select all the files in here, drag them into add-on PED. So now what you want to do is open up your add-on PEDs editor, run it as administrator. Okay, here it is. Uh, what you want to do is go to PEDs, add PED, just name it Iron. Okay. Um, and then um, what we're going to put PED model name, we're going to put MK46. 
46 uh, as you guys can see mk is capitalized it has to be the exact name as a file if it's capitalized here it has to be capitalized over here pet type normal add pet and then click rebuild okay we can x that out also let's go back to our gta over here gta 5 click your mods folder update update the rpf common data you should have a dlc list here drag that to your desktop okay so let me open this with notepad uh here let's go back to our uh, add-on pads website and there should be a line here item dlc packs add-on pads copy that go to your dlc list press enter and paste it all right now let's save this drag it back into open iv now we're gonna start part two of the installation process okay this is part two of the installation process if you don't want the iron man slash tony stark house you don't have to do this you can skip ahead what you need for this is iron man slash tony stark house and then map editor so what you want to do is open up your main directory again all right click your scripts folder click map editor select all the files drag them into your scripts folder all right we can x that out now the tony stark house iron man and then we have um object list drag that into your scripts folder too replace all right so we have iron man house map and iron man suits what you want to do is click map editor and click iron man house here drag ironman.xml to your map editor okay it should be there all right so now we have iron man suits left we can exit out our main directory let's open up open iv okay so now what we want to do is scroll down Look for x64g, right click, copy to mods folder. Alright, so once x64g is done copying into your mods folder, uh, click your mods folder, x64g, levels, GTA 5, generic, cuts object, click edit mode, press yes, okay. Let's start with war machine suit, select everything in here, drag into your x64g levels gta 5 generic cuts object okay all right next let's go to iron man original select all the files drag them in the same folder x64g levels gta 5 generic cuts object okay last is iron man gray suit select everything drag into here okay we're done with that now all we have to do is start up gta all right so once you open up grand theft auto what you want to do is press ctrl n and then you should see iron man click enter uh, scroll down to equip armor mk46 you can use your arrow keys to scroll and there iron man is um i'll leave the controls in the description but i believe it's e to change attacks all right so now let's load up map editor and load the map uh tony stark's house so press f7 and there is map editor click enter or actually scroll down to load map go to file chooser and then go to scripts folder scroll down to map editor and there it is ironman.xml so it might freeze for a bit it might lag so i'm gonna pause it until it's done so i believe it's done loading the map let me x out of map editor i believe you press f7 and then x out of map editor okay so this is where it says it's located this is where his house is located i'm not sure let me see if that's the place. It should be somewhere around there. Let me fly over there. Uh, flying on this is hard, but I believe if you just keep on pressing W, it should work. All right, so I see his house. This is his house. This is his base. I don't know where the entrance is. So let me try to find the entrance. All right, so the entrance is over here. All right, yeah, there is his house. There is his base. All right, you guys, thank you for watching. If this tutorial helped you out, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys for watching.